Look at this. <laughs> Ooh. Yay. Yeah. It's yeah. So good. Okay, um, so I'm I'm glad we're including all the little levels too. Oh yeah. We're gonna have all the little levels and everything. So um I think oh. um we can we can sort of do a tier force style and just take turns picking and oh, talk like and that. talk about them. Yeah. So, um, you, you mean tears of the kingdom style? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Tears of the kingdom style. We, we, don't, want to <laughs> we don't want to confuse well, it. Other with show, it. an old show. There's another a very one. different, very different show. Yeah. Yeah. Um, why don't we let our guests pick first? Uh, Deimos, if you want to start us off and pick a, pick a course to rank. I feel like it's only fair to start with Bomb on Battlefield. That's what I was the thinking, first, but okay. Yeah. So, yeah, let's do that. Um, what are my thoughts? Uh, as a first level, I think it's absolutely amazing. Like, when you get inside of it, uh, you, you start in this area where nobody can attack you, and uh, you're safe. So you can take your time, talk to, like, the pink bomb, -bomb read the little sign, there are boxes you can punch and jump on. Like it's, it's all uh, kind of a small tutorial area within the game, uh, within the level, and you can see far away already everything that's on the level. You can see the mountain in the background. You can, like it, it you have a, a, an overview of where you can go, and um, I like how the first star is something that's very straightforward. Like it won't confuse you. It's just go there, beat that person. And it starts you from the bottom, all the, and you need to go all the way to the other side of the map at the top. Makes you go through the whole level, see everything in one go. Uh, so I think that's very smart of them because that's the first star everyone's going to do. Uh, For sure, yeah. yeah. I, I uh, think it's also I, really cool that the sixth star is something that's easily gettable. So you'll usually get it before reaching that star. So it teaches you that you don't have to do them in order. So I really think it's brilliant. Yeah. I, I, I think the, the level is iconic, you know? It, like, I, giving it any lower than S, I feel, for me, <laughs> would, be hard, would be hard to do. It's, it's just so iconic of a level. Mm -hmm. I, I, I mean, I agree with you. I, uh, everything Dave must said, I pretty much agree with, too. And... It's going to be hard, though, because a lot of these courses are iconic, I think. But yes. I think I think we can be reasonable. I mean, McKenna, what do you what do you think? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's, it's definitely one of the first ones I uh, think of when I think about this game. Uh... Yeah, I think it's one of the best. Uh... Like yeah. one of the best type of intro things in any video yeah. game in general. Yeah. Good, good intro to a lot of things. Uh... It, it was an intro to 3D for a lot of people. That mm -hmm. that's true. That's true. And I mean, it does a good job of onboarding you in that sense too. I mean, I guess too, you get a good. The game in general gives you a good lead up because you have the whole mm -hmm. courtyard and castle. But yeah. yeah. But um, yeah, I think it touches on every type of stars too. Like you got fight a boss, be quick, mm -hmm. uh, find the red stars, obviously, uh, find the star hidden in the level. Uh, Teaches you about war. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. There's like, there's good lore there for sure. <laughs> no, I, I think, I, I think it's S tier as well. Yeah. King, King Babam is such a cool, memorable character. Yeah. Um, the chain chomp always freaked me out as a kid, and and like mm -hmm. getting it is, was stressful. Mm -hmm. And then race racing Koopa the Quick was always fun. Yeah, S tier, yeah. S tier for sure. All right, all right. Okay. Um, I think Michael. Yeah, Michael, you go. Um. Oh, am I choosing one? Yeah, yes. choose one to um... rank. I don't, don't waste don't waste all the good ones by the way. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um okay. Well, then 
let's let's choose the oh i forget what it's called it's it's the one under the the moat i think where you get the vanish cap for the oh, first time okay yeah that would be the one with the blue the blue uh switch right yeah the yeah. blue switch level yeah. okay okay uh i mean this level is it's i it's not too much of a level itself you know you just kind of collect the red coins uh and make it to the end of the level um it's got some i guess platforming uh towards the second half of it um i i think i wouldn't say it's bad or good i'd probably just put it like b somewhere average Okay, I think it's the best of the hat, the hat courses. Do we agree with that? I agree. Um, sure, yeah, I agree with that. I feel I like would the... still not put it at B though. I think that's too high. I guess it depends on what how how we feel our tiers are ranking. Yeah. Is it Quaid? Did Quaid join us? Hello. Hey, hey Quaid. Hi, Quaid. Like, hello. We you stalled as much as we could. Let's. Uh... <laughs> Uh, let's... Uh, sorry for the delay. No, you're you're perfect. Let's catch you up. All we've done is ranked Bob on Battlefield, and we put it in S tier. What do you think about that? Here's. Oh yeah, that's a good introduction level. Yeah. Okay. You need. Okay. A very solid map. Here's my question: Is there? Uh, I see we have an S, A, B, C, and E. So do we have like an F tier? Because uh, I. I'm, do you feel I'm, like something should be F tier? Well, I'm I'm going I'm going with with the for the vanish cap level in B because right now with the tier list I'm seeing that's about as in the middle as you can get. I I yeah, think yeah, these are our tiers. I, I think there are no yeah. not going to be any levels that are going to suck, so we're only ranking them between each other. And I really think it's on the lower end because it's very short, uh, not particularly I, memorable. I do have I an idea of something that would go in a lower tier than it, though. Yeah, I'll I'll be I'll be honest. It, it I mean it's short, but as far as like the play, the enjoyment of playing it. Oh, I I would definitely rank some lower. I, I want to throw out uh, Quaid. We're talking about the, the Vanish Cap level, where you get the Vanish Cap. Right, right. Okay, cool. Uh, just in case you missed that. Um, yeah. I think... I I would I would probably put it in the C tier, where I think it's fun, but obviously it's, it is just kind of limited by... Um, there's Besides. other... There's other sure. short courses that I think I would even well they're not short but I don't know. I well, think it's I'll, fine. Okay. I'll give it I'll I'll, I'll give it this for uh, this and this would be a, a, an argument to myself on why <laughs> it would go in C instead. And it's because I think even if there are some courses that are worse like gameplay wise there is definitely there are some hard and bad courses that i would also argue are pretty cool like world designs in it big time yeah and maybe that alone would increase some of those in ranking so sure yeah i think c makes sense yeah. for the vanish cap okay does everyone else agree yeah personally i would have put it at e but i, I can agree to c that's fine well can i pitch what i think i would put in e and then, <laughs> oh, and... oh, when you choose your next, oh. there. <laughs> <laughs> well, Quaid, are yeah. you okay with Vanish Cap and C? <sighs> See, I'm torn because I, I enjoy it. It's not a very, it's obviously not very big, but its purpose is to get the Vanish Cap. I would see it as a B Ooh. in my eyes because of just how simplistic it is. It's just, you know, the coins are right there. I could see your C argument because are you complaining about maybe getting red coins to where? If you don't realize that they're right there, you have to go back and do it again. 
That's not so like, bad. What's your, I don't what's your argument? I was going to say, like, what, what's your main argument about making it C tier? Just the quality of it overall, or? It, it's just that um, it's it's pretty straightforward. You do kind of, you get the Vanish Cap, but it's really, you know, you do kind of one thing, and it's not. Yeah, yeah. And like, that's all it's meant to be. There there are other yeah. levels where I feel like you do you do only one thing, but it's, like, slightly more exciting. The, the yeah. way I see the tier list is that the C section is the average, like, yeah down the road okay yeah and b b is like good a is great and then s is like perfection we're nice no, here I... there's nothing really f but that's yeah. right okay I, with that with, with that Michael. with that explanation i will 100 percent agree it would be a c tier it is a pretty average just course it, there's nothing really bad about it i like it it's nice and short and it gets its point across like what you got to do does it even have a name I think, I think it's like beneath the moat or something. I might, I might uh, be making, I might be making that up, but you know. Oh, <laughs> uh, McKenna. Yeah. McKenna. Yeah. Is that fine? C tier. Uh, yeah. Okay. I don't really have strong feelings. <laughs> okay, let's do it. <laughs> yeah, this is not one I would die on a hill on. Let's put McKenna it that way. is a good a fresh viewpoint. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm all if, is. if she's completely yeah, neutral, then that's then, then that, that, that's a sign. <laughs> that's true. Okay, we have another we have another guest now. So Quaid, I think you can pick whatever one you want to rank next. Mm. And like I was saying, don't waste all the good ones right away, or else yeah, I'm to, it won't be as fun. Of, uh, how about we do Wet Dry World? Oh, mm. okay. <laughs> some people feel kind of. The little buggy. Some people sound like they're a little oh, buggy about it. There we go. <laughs> no, there's literally a buggy. Buggy. Mm -hmm. Um, the concept of raising and lowering the water level is really fun. Yeah. Getting to said some of those is a little difficult, depending. Mm -hmm. You have that little bonus town that has two stars hanging out over there. The town is awesome. Yeah, I, yeah, the I town like is great though. The bonus town alone is what makes me feel like this would be like B tier, at least a B tier in my eyes because of that. Fine, <laughs> I would put it at C tier, but I can agree. Well, why would you put it at C tier? Like, what, what's I, your feeling towards? I don't it? think it's. I think it's one of the least memorable courses, at least as far as the fifteen regular, like. Levels go definitely with the challenges too. I feel like none of the and challenges. Yeah. Stand you don't out. remember what? Yeah, like you remember? Oh, one of them is going in the town, in the town, getting the, the red coins. But then it's just like, can you really name them all by heart? I, they're not memorable. It's like, <laughs> go there, touch that random thing, go there. Well, remember, just, it feels unimaginative as far as the stars go. I, I, I feel like um, if it's put in hold C on, tier, hold on, hold on. okay. <laughs> there is a Panera ad playing right now. <laughs> oh, oh no! no. There is no. a Panera ad playing right now on my phone. Oh my god! What? Oh, who? It's not on the stream. I was hearing a Panera ad, and I was like freaking out. Like, <laughs> what is going on? I was like, I don't, I don't know where it is. <laughs> uh, this tier list is totally sponsored by, <laughs> by Panera. Panera. <laughs> I was like, uh, we cannot not have not a. Sure. It was just me. I was like, oh shit, we can have a Panera ad playing on the stream. <laughs> so, That's Panera I... Bread, uh, B tier? Uh, okay, sorry. Who, who's talking to? I, 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 um, I would say if it goes in C tier, it'd probably be like a high C tier. If it's in B, it'd probably be on the lower end of the B tiers. Are, are we ranking within well, the tiers too? Or well, not? like, uh, uh, like a... sure. Well, no, let's not. Let's not. Okay. Well, okay. here's the deal. Like a plus and minus on grades, it doesn't matter because it's the actual letter. Okay. Matters. Okay. So we're not doing that. We're not putting them in. Mm. The no, then we'll be here all day, and I don't want to okay. do that. Yeah, no. <laughs> then it'd be a bigger argument. <laughs> then I feel B. I I'm okay with B. Um. I'm okay with B. Let's do B and then see what happens, because... This can always change. I agree. It could change. Yeah. I do I agree. Like we're like... going to have a, a giant F. Like, we're going to have, like, a lot at the top, very few at the bottom at the end. 
Yeah, <laughs> which more is understandable because we kind of love the yeah. game too much. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah that's true. Um, I think oh, McK- McKenna. We have to see another. Uh, McKenna's gonna pick me. one now. Um, which which one do I wanna? Let me make sure I know uh, which which thing is which on here. Well, we've got right now. You're um, over. Uh, oh, you know what I wanna do? <laughs> where where is it? Oh, this one. The boo. Oh, the, yeah, it's yeah, the left. Yeah, oh, yeah. Wait, yeah. Oh, I see the outline. I was thinking that was like Okay. <laughs> yeah, uh, the, yeah. Big Boo is Haunt. Uh, well, as we all know, this is my favorite one to, uh, get. <laughs> to go for yeah. a dip in. Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, the spooky vibes to me already put it <laughs> it's it's s tier oh, no. i don't even know okay. uh, yeah I, I can't even argue it being lower than s tier because there's so many good stars they put a lot more effort into it than like wet dry world and obviously the uh going for a dip in the merry-go-round <laughs> the falling over and over it's one of the highlights yeah uh, and then that one on the roof you gotta get that yep <laughs> oh yeah yeah Oh, and the mystery oh, library. The free, oh, it's got even got the piano that turns into trying to bite you. Such good you keep going. Vibes. Yeah, there's oh, there's the, so much good stuff about this. The movie. merry-go-round at the bottom of the level. Mm-hmm. So much attention to detail. And the eyeballs that you have to make get dizzy to destroy. Yeah. There's so much. There, there's so many memorable enemies. All the giant boo fights. Even entering the level is one of the like yeah. more unique ways to enter a level in the game. Yeah. Definitely. Absolutely. It's the first one I think of the yeah you know, of the major levels that uh, has a different way to get into it. So you can and you can get there right from the get go, right? Yeah. No, you actually. I think it's a certain amount of stars you gotta get. Yeah. So the boo oh. shows up. But oh, I get to wait okay, okay. for the boon the hallway oh, yeah. to actually enter. But that's that's cool on its own, where it's like just like, oh crap, what 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 are these doing here? You know, a boo yeah. stands at a hallway. Yeah, like it it's wasn't there like, yeah. really when you're looking around, and then it's just there staring at you. And you're like, oh, I'm gonna go check him out, and he starts running away, and you're like, oh, this is haunted now. People yeah. playing that for the first time, that's got to be scary. Very frightening. Yeah, <laughs> that piano. It's just the worst or the best. <laughs> the piano. <laughs> so uh, B for boo? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> S. S I didn't like the piano scaring me guys. It's instantly an E. I didn't like to be jump scared. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay. Now I can I go. <laughs> yep. All right. I think we should put. Uh, you know, I actually love this one. Weirdly, just for the vibe, but just thinking about. The actual gameplay, it's like, just doesn't hold a candle to almost anything else in the game. And it's that one where you're swimming in the room that's just like a swimming around the, the uh, this, yeah. This guy? I don't know what that is. It's just like a hidden. It's, it's, yeah. It's Lost that, swim room. What's it called? I, it doesn't um, have a name. I've been checking for the, the secret level names and I don't find it. It's yeah, one cool. of the it's castle cool. secret stars. I call it yeah. the water trap room. Yeah. Because so you're trapped until ball. you get the star. Oh, wait. I, I think I did found it. Uh, you oh. The other one was Vanish Cap Under the Moat. Okay. And, uh, this one is a secret aquarium. Okay. I mean, I like it just conceptually in the game. I think it's, like, cool finding a hidden level where you just collect red coins. You know, like, I don't, I don't hate it. That's why, it, like, I yeah. wouldn't put it in yeah. an actual F tier. But just... Game, you know, it's, comparatively, it's not that exciting. It's kind of, it's it's kind of just testing your swimming. Good vibes. Yeah. I think I, E for uh, effort is what I would say. <laughs> I actually prefer it over the Vanish Cap level, but I can, since I would have put that at E, I can agree with that being at E as well. Okay. I, 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 I feel really like, like the vibes. I feel like I'd put it at, like, C. Yeah, I would put it at C at this point. I think okay. I'd put it at E. <laughs> It's okay. a tier. Um, McKenna's the tiebreaker then. Yes. Yeah. Let's put it at C. What the hell? All right. <laughs> Betrayal. 
I feel like okay. he's almost too low for it, you know? <laughs> like, I don't I don't hate, not, not that anything in E I would hate, but I feel like That's, there's nothing okay. that would frustrate me about, about that level. Mm -hmm. Okay. Is anything going to go in? That's why I was trying, I was trying <laughs> to put something. Uh, <laughs> we're too nice. Well, it's my turn next, and here's what I think is going to go on E. Um, okay, yeah. this is this is what we should do now. It's everyone has to try to put one in E. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yes. <laughs> okay, so, okay. The one I would put in E is uh, another secret level. The one where you go in the clouds, but not the the red um one. Oh yeah, the, the red, clouds uh, one. Which the Next other one? The, yes. Uh, yeah, right to the left of the red. I I think this is probably the worst standalone level. I uh, agree. Yeah. It's mm -hmm. not particularly fun. You've already done something similar. And then it's right next to a level that's the same, but way better. <laughs> it's, it's a very punishing level, too. Yeah. I, I, it's really punishing. If, if you fail, do you start back like outside? Is it one of those? Or yeah, no? I think it sends you outside into the water. Like so it's very desk, annoying right? to redo every time, if that's the case. And you gotta um, go back oh, in and all the way up. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, it's Keep just a hassle. Thing. And if you're really bad at the jumping, you, you're going to have a hard time getting back into the level. <laughs> yeah. And for okay. that reason, it's out. E for exhausting. Yeah, I'm, I'm E okay. for an exhaust. Easy E, <laughs> yeah. All right. Cool. Well, then, Michael, I guess you don't have to you don't have to pick an E then, but, I mean, if you got one. E's fulfilled. Um, I don't know if I have one. That's uh, fine. That's fine. So instead, uh, I I want to I want to choose cool cool mountain. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> um. This one. I I think all around it's kind of a a good level. The only star that I would have a complaint about is is maybe a little bit of the red coin star. Um. Really. I can understand why. <laughs> yeah, not not that it's like, not that it's like bad. I I'm thinking about you know somebody first gets a Nintendo sixty four. You know, back in back in the day. <laughs> I, you know, I'm and, envisioning myself as a kid. Yeah, Keep envision going. yourself <laughs> as a kid, and then you you get into Cool Cool Mountain, and you're looking for these red coins, and they're just they're deeply hidden around some places. <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't know. I was a kid. I played that game, and uh, <laughs> that was fine. The red coins were were fine to get. It's it's like I, the first level; they're just spread around. And, well, there's some conditions. Five other people telling them where the red coins are. <laughs> <laughs> well, here's the deal with the red coin conditions. On that map, you have to know where to get. You have to have that shell to get those two red coins in that water that acts like lava. Oh wait, no, no you're, not, you're no, thinking no, 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 of. Uh, Oh, I'm uh, thinking of the other mountain. I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah. I'm wow. Yep. Yeah. Well, sorry. there's there's two snowman based levels, so you know. I, I get know. It. I was yeah. I was thinking um, of the latter. Yep. Yeah. I well, if hmm. if the red coin part isn't isn't like that, I that big of a deal. I will say that two of the stars are basically just doing the slide. Um. And I feel like, I feel like, you know, I, I, I'm saying that I think this could go in A tier. Like, I think it's a great, <laughs> like, dare it, you. it's a, it's a great level. I just don't think that there's there, it, it gets the full use out of like, like it's stars. I, uh, mm. to me it's an S tier. I love that level so much. I think it's super enjoyable. You can go everywhere right away you don't need to unlock anything and uh it's true that you have to do that race twice but i don't know it's a fun race <laughs> i don't think the yeah i don't think the race is bad because the first one's just it's... a trial of seeing the map the second oh, yeah. one's actually doing a race and i he's love that if you try to cheat in the fair. second race he's like no <laughs> bad mario bad and it's like oh <laughs> that's one thing yeah, i like is that the first fair. time you can you can you can do the shortcut and then like it, and like get the star still, but then they up the difficulty, and I feel like that's a nice 
continuation from the secret slide level. Like, I think it's a good, you know, sort of upping the game, you know, less bumpers and making it a little mm-hmm. bit harder and kind of easing you oh, into that, it. And it's another difficulty level to the slide. So you yes. have two difficulty and slide levels. Let's not or... forget when you, when you beat the game or whatever we did, you get the fat mm-hmm. penguin. Yeah. So it's the only level that changes uh, according to uh, <laughs> full completion. Uh, let's not forget we can also so, so murder everyone... a penguin child. So is that's that... it for me. <laughs> Is that is yeah, there yeah. everyone else thinking S over A? Not necessarily. Okay. <laughs> you're saying you're saying A, Quades. What what are you at? I, think, I mean, right now it's like really close to S for me, but I'd still keep it close in the A tier. Okay. I would still say A tier. Like it's a quote unquote A plus, but it's still A. Damos <laughs> is S. McKenna yes. is. Hmm. You bring the baby to the mom. That's cute. That is, yeah, that is cute. But you can like kill that baby too. Throw us a curveball yeah. curve. <laughs> curve and say E. <laughs> <laughs> or if you uh, give the penguin the wrong baby, you can just like, oh, this what penguin's it? done. Wall jumps. <laughs> wall jumps will work. It's fun. I I really love the sixth star of that level. I think it's super fun. I do yeah. think the wall jumps is a very good star because the... it it it's it really. It really tests somebody's skills. I'm kind of on the fence. I want to say well. S. The snow. The snow okay, man. I think <laughs> I think we got enough pressure for S. Okay. That I think we have to abide by it. I just the only thing I will say is the <clears> snowman <throat> head thing. I dislike how accurate it feels like you got to be with following Ooh, it. Oh yeah, that, that can be some doesn't trouble. Work right. That's true. That, that's what brings it down to an A for me. At least that. That yeah. Alone. And the red coin hunt, if you don't know where they're at, because you're there for a while trying to find them. Well, I I can see the fifth star being a point of contention. It really is the weakest one of them all because you don't know what you're doing wrong. So, like, yeah. we knew that you just had to go fa- faster, but someone who hasn't doesn't have a guide will just be completely confused. Mm. And don't yeah, you'll be like, I, I'm following it. I'm trying yeah, to show I, it where it goes, but it's not so working. Weird. I had that problem as a kid. Like, I was like, what am I doing wrong? <laughs> Do we want to go? Let's go A then. I feel like that's safe. It's okay. I'll shed a tear. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can blame the snowman head for that tear. <laughs> yeah, put that up in A. I'll, I'll call it karma for killing that uh, penguin so many times. <laughs> oh, my God. oh, my God. Well, who said snowman land? That was Michael? What? Yes. Okay, so Quaid, Quaid gets to pick one. Oh, yeah. Well, let's get rid of one I'm not a fan of. Okay. Uh, dire Dire Docks. Mm. That's the top left one, right? Yeah. With the weird one. So I will give. But the submarine, so, come on. So there's positives and negatives. The submarine. Just, but that submarine disappears after you get the star. Oh, well, yeah. So you have and, more and room you to climb around. You never see it again. If you select yeah. the star again, it does not respawn. That it's adds to the up. mystique. Yeah, but what if you want to see that sub again? You have to start over. You got to oh, delete your here's, file. Here's something oh, I'll say about this level that that you that some people might not know is that the red coins in that level don't show up until after you beat the second Bowser. Really? Oh, oh. so that is, that if if you go is that good through or bad? that. Yeah, if you go through that level, like it, it, like you want to do the levels in in order before going on to the next thing, and you try going through all of Dire Dire Docks, you're gonna hit those poles, and they're just gonna be empty. There's gonna be no red coins there. That's so interesting. That's oh, sucks. sorry, no, the red coins are there. It's the it's the poles that don't show up. Oh, <laughs> that's, that's even weirder. Oh, yeah, that's so, even like, weirder. <laughs> you get in there and you see red coins floating in Wait, the air, and it's like, how do I get those? Why? So, why is Bowser like in mm. control of the poles so much? <laughs> Who knows? Is this the one that I tried to do? <laughs> like I started to collect the red coins. I don't remember you, and you ditched it. Yeah, I was like, oh, I can't do this yet. Yeah, oh, they, it, it was probably this level because. Yeah, the poles don't show up. controls the poles. <laughs> Apparently. This, it's, I don't know, it's one of my, I like, 
I also like uh, the cap where you have to, or the star where you have to wear two caps at once. No, that's not it. It's actually two different stars that are, have one cap each. That's what we figured out last time. Oh, yeah, like, we remember it, you just it, it went super disappointing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because I always had the assumption you oh, were both this to get sucks, to that star. Then. All right, you put, it where, right put it wherever you want. It was misleading, and <laughs> oh, no, <dude. laughs> remember how hard it was finding all hundred coins. <laughs> it is a very oh, yeah. hard to find all 100 coins. Yeah, there's not. I, there's not a lot of coins surplus either. Like e tier. <laughs> there's some contention around mm. this one, but I think it has. There's some cool vibes it has on offer, and it, it's starting to remind me of Wet Dry World, where there's a. There, it has some cool stuff, but there's also some mm. middling stuff. <laughs> yes, the there's... submarine is pretty cool. There's a lot of ups and downs. There's several ups and downs. I, I wish you could say. go into the submarines. That would have been nice. <clears throat> I wish you could drive the damn thing. <laughs> oh, yeah, like yeah. you could nest it. Dire Dire Dark is my least favorite of the main levels, I would say. If, okay, okay. So I literally if forget it, about it every time. If it's not an so E tier, we... it's at least a C tier at best. I agree. I'm saying B. I think it's better than, I, you know. I wouldn't put it below. These two. I think it's more fun than like the Vanish cap. Okay, so we got mm -hmm. two. Yeah, see, Matt, Matt is chiming okay. in saying C, but. Here's the thing if we were ranking them within the tiers, I would put it at a high C, <laughs> but because we're not, I'm going to put it. I think, I think I'd think i put it in a B. Ah, oh, okay. Man. We've got two Bs, a mm. C. You've got three Bs and two Cs, actually. Well, what do you and I, I are thinking C. All right, we. I think. I think you have uh, two C's. We're saying okay. Then I think we got to go B. I was gonna we say can... E actually, but I'll, I was. But it's okay. <laughs> you are because <laughs> that changes too. the. Is that ever just it to a C? <laughs> I think it kind of yeah, does. Right? <laughs> well, <laughs> I guess uh, we I could... did say I put it in a high C. Like, All right, a, I... a perfect ranking scenario. Okay, yeah, well. I'm okay with that, even though we're not doing that. I think I'm, I would, you know, let's even do it. Even though we're not doing that, we're totally doing that sometimes. <laughs> our, uh, I think we got to be reasonable, too. About it. I don't want to top load the list. Yeah. yeah. Not um, everyone will have to be a banger. <laughs> I guess McKenna can go, yeah. Mm. You, uh, you like the stained glass peach? yeah the peach the peaches slide or whatever it's called yeah this is the just secret the slide. secret the secret uh, slide it's a slide this is, this is fun it's, yeah it is it's fun. a good you know first slide adventure you know it's easy but mm -hmm. it's good you know, beginner thing plus you get to jump through a, a window to find it so that's pretty cool uh Hmm. Oh, it does have that challenge of you got to beat it. Is it under 21 seconds to get the second star? There? Yeah. So it's there's another a, difficulty. It's another so star. If we did that, I missed that. <laughs> yeah, there, there's yeah, two stars on that, that level. You get one star for just doing it, and then you have to beat a time limit to yeah. get the second star. Oh, wow. A nice little difficulty challenge. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's a nice short little map. I mean,. It doesn't have to be an S tier. I'd at least say an A tier, just because the. Whoa! Really? I was thinking I, B. I, I mean, really. You know, I it's like... really good at what it does, but I don't think it has enough stuff yeah. in it to like be ranked super highly. I was thinking C, and okay. then you talked me up to a B. <laughs> <laughs> I'll I go mean, with the B. I, I, I feel like A is probably too high too. Yeah, I think just because it is very. It reminds I'm... me, like I was saying about the aquatic room, where it's like. Uh, it's more fun than that, but it's and like the concept is cool or like how you find it and it's a good intro to the slide, but there's not mm -hmm. uh, other than that. It's like a couple slide races, you know, it's not like, yeah, I mean, that's all it offers cool. too. But I think of it more. Well, yeah. Okay. I, I'm, I'm, I'm saying B unless B, B. I, I wasn't going to agree with C, but we can go B too. I agree with B. B. It, okay. It's better quality than the other two mini. Oh. B for the oh. best of the secret <laughs> levels. Yes. For now. Okay. I want to do the wing cap. 
the red uh, the red the, one at the end yeah, the yeah. Red, uh, okay which what do you think? i think it's cool um like just the way you find it is really awesome yeah sure. it it's again it's like a lot of these secret ones where i think it's pretty cool but obviously not a lot on offer um the one challenge on it is i think probably even less exciting than that other cloud one but it's pretty like it's pretty replayable like you fall you look up you do it again and i i kind of have fun with it but i'd say it's, it's pretty mid because like you you're gonna yeah. have to do at least twice first time you go in there you're not gonna know about the getting the right coins like that yeah so which is fine yeah so i'd probably say a c it's average if okay. there was ever going to be another E, I think it would be this one. I think so, too. Because mm -hmm. it's, I think it's a little annoying that if you fall, you have to look back up. And you don't let us, don't get a second chance for the, the red coins. If you screw up, it's just, I have to go all the way back and then well, try again. And then, yeah. The one benefit of it is it doesn't kick you out of the castle. I think it puts You're, you You are right just right you're... there. Yeah. yeah. I, I, so I'm saying it's better than the other I, one, but it's still a knee. I agree. I think I, I think that as well. Um, high I don't e. know. I, I'm not yeah, a high E. I'm not, <laughs> I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not too big of a fan of of mm. the flying mechanics sometimes uh in this game. Well, give me a break. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's okay, but it it, <laughs> it was done as well as it could at the time. I mean, so yeah. I mean, it, yeah. for for its time, they're pretty impressive. But... Absolutely. But when you line it up with all these other ones, yeah, it's not very high up there at all, or yeah. pretty pretty bottom of the bucket. So okay, I can see that being an E rank as well, but I would still say probably a C. I'm 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 down with high E. I think we got yeah. I think we got majority E's right. Yeah. yeah, yeah, you do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's go for it. Put it above that one because we're yeah. definitely not doing that. <laughs> Obviously not. Yeah, we're not doing yeah. that. There we go. Yeah, there the we go. one's probably. Oh. Uh, back to Damus or Michael, oh, whoever. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Um. Yeah, you just picked. So. Right. Right. Yeah. yeah. Um. All right. Let's go with a level. Let's go with one of the Bowser level. Let's go with the first Bowser level. Okay, Bowser wow, in the really Dark really World, I think it's called. Uh, yeah, 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 the yeah. first of the image, the 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 one left of the lava. Yeah. Well. yeah. Okay. Um, I I really like this one. Um, I, I love all the probably, Bowser levels. Yeah, actually. I love all yeah. of them. Uh, but I'm thinking that it's just uh, it, it's like a lesser version of the the final one, uh, and it, and it doesn't dis it, it doesn't distinguish itself. From the like the first and third Bowser level are pretty similar in what they look like, while the second one differs itself by being a lava level. Uh, I I would put it at B, personally. I love it, but I think it's also it has the curse of just having like one run through, maybe two if you get the red coins, and that's it. And the red coins are not particularly fun to get. Uh, they're okay, but yeah. I would put it at B, but I can be convinced otherwise. I would agree I, on B. B for Bowser. I, I I would possibly agree with B or maybe even an A. Um, I my my thing is that I I wouldn't necessarily want to rank something lower just because it's like a one run through kind of thing. Yes, you're right. Um. Because that just means it could be short but sweet. Well, I will say the these cha the platforming challenges and the Bowser levels are like my favorite in the game. Like I actually yeah. love that it's like a straight. It reminds me of classic Mario, you know. Yeah, but in three D. I I think I'd say A for me. I, I can I can go A for sure. The one thing I will only argue is I kind of see these three Bowser levels as their own separate rankings. All okay. of them as in, like, you mean? as in, like, I want to see one as an S, an A, and a B well, rank. Yes, and rest. if we were to do that, I think it's the lowest one. But yeah. I'll... Do we want to just try to uh, do that right now and knock them all out? If if you want, we could do that. Uh, yeah, sure. If I I would be okay with them going up a, a tier per level. Okay. 
That's how I feel about yeah. those. Yeah. Yeah. I would be great. Perfect. <laughs> I would see yeah. that one. The first level is definitely a B rank level when you yeah, compare to the other two. I would go be a S in order, honestly. Especially if we're also con considering like the Bowser fights at the end as part part of it. Oh, for sure. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. They get they get, they get better <laughs> as it goes on. Yeah, they just improve. Okay. I mean Absolutely. it sounds like everyone is okay with that. What do you think, McKenna? Yeah, that that sounds good. <laughs> that sounds, sounds great. <laughs> All right. All right. B A S. B. Uh, uh, they're in order there. So the lava yeah. one. No, no. The uh, the oh. next one is the well, yeah. That yeah. one. Oh, yeah. okay. Okay. And then the last one. Or yeah, yeah. Ooh. Boom. Yeah. The wow. la I can't. Look yeah. Those are so awesome. I think it, it I makes sense to kind of think about them comparison to each other because, like, it's yeah. difficult. Like, Michael was talking about the length. Like, we've got Peach's slide here in B, but also compared <laughs> to Wet Dry World, which has, like, six <laughs> stars or whatever. It's kind yeah. of, it's sort of apples and oranges a little bit. So I feel like for what they're doing, like, you're right. They're really good. Yeah. Yeah. The nice thing okay. about the battle is they only get better when you get to the next one. Well, cool. That was very, um, that was very straightforward. We got a lot done. That was a very productive round. Um, good. Three and done. Is that uh, who just who did that? Who's passing? That was, that was hey, me. So now it's Michael. All right, Michael. Can I talk about TikTok clock? <laughs> it's your redemption. Yes. Hey. Okay. So <laughs> I'm going to start off by saying where I think I would rank it. Okay. And I think I would rank it in B. Um, Whoa! I the mm -hmm. the level can be very frustrating, and it's a very hard one hundred star or one hundred coin <laughs> star to get. <laughs> no way! <laughs> it's easy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, but you just need orange juice. <laughs> I feel from a both a mechanics and a thematics standpoint it is a very well done level um i think mm -hmm. the idea of it being inside of a giant clock and having all these gears and stuff is really cool and the ability to change those depending on what time you go in is is i don't know there's a lot of charm to that mm -hmm. um Yes. So although it is frustrating and and sometimes very uh, hard to navigate, I think I think it deserves B for for that. Well, shoot, you know, I was gonna stick up mm -hmm. for it, but then I realized you had played it the most. Like I barely played it, but yeah. Uh, what does everyone I, else think? I agree. Uh, I was thinking maybe C, but because of the mechanics. Whoa! Oh, yes. Whoa. I, 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 it's not one of my favorite levels. I think it's it's visually boring. Um, Whoa! And, I, Whoa. and the stars feel a bit all samey, just like go to a different part of the level. But I do really love how you can change the tempo. Uh, and because of that, it can go up to B, in my opinion. <laughs> Let's hear what Quaid has to say. <laughs> I really love this map. <laughs> okay, thank you. Good, good, good. Okay. And and I didn't I... know about that last uh, that last speed that we I found out about how it. Okay. Uh, yeah. I can concede that if you're somebody who really enjoys a challenge, which then, I I'm not, then then, I would, <laughs> then no, I do. You but... know, this could get ranked higher. Um, so I'm not I'm I'm willing to let it go up to an A. I won't fight that. <laughs> but I do not think it's an S, but I will say it's at least an A. But because as, of that, as so. somebody who likes a good balance between fun and vibing and something being challenging, um, I I would say it's it's a good level. It's a good level. I, not I great, love... but good. I... E. Okay, I would have. I think this is one of the best ones we've talked about so far. I didn't do it as I, I like. I, I know where you're coming from because I was too intimidated to do it on stream, mostly because I didn't want to 
just keep failing on stream but like this is honestly one of my favorite ones to actually play but i was and like one... it'd be painful for me to try attempt you know when we get the the god gamers the god mario gamers here so. <laughs> it is but, also one of the last two courses so it's gotta have that difficulty notch up a little bit. Out of that's true two that's last also courses, true. though i much prefer the other one i think it's more visually appealing the, the stars are more interesting to get to that's uh, true so, I, I I mean, disagree. Put, yeah, oof, I mean, if I, we no agree to put this on an Wait. A, we'll have to put the other one. Wait, sorry, close. <laughs> we'll get to okay. that one. Wait, wait, wait. Mm. Um, sorry, Demos. You said you said you <laughs> you didn't think the star you the stars are what? Uh. He said the re- stars in the uh, rainbow one were yeah, more uh, fun the to rainbow get to. Of, yes. Oh. Because um. you, you talked about a challenge. And <laughs> I mean, I, 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 fine. You guys might think, oh, <laughs> you just have to wait for a. a, a I don't think that. No, on. no. <laughs> okay. Okay. I, no, but I do. Yeah, I, I think it is a little more challenging, but w- I don't know. I prefer uh, the other one. I think it's a more fun challenge. Whereas this one, I, I feel like I repeat the same level six times. Doing doing six times the same thing, except I going can, a little further. Wait. I can agree to that because that the last level, every star is a completely different path. Yes, exactly, they just, start, they just start breaking apart. So if TikTok is going to rank a B or an A, that means the Rainbow Cruise has to be one higher than that, or at least the same. I I would put if, it higher, if, but I at least it's not the same higher. Yeah, I was going to say it's not the same higher. For sure, but they're like the last two courses of the game. And when where, you look at them both, I, where would McKenna, where would you put the tick tock clock? Uh, I guess it, I was initially thinking A. I was thinking S. I would put it above every, well, almost, at, well, not everyone, but that's true. Uh, I was, so... I, I was in very initially thinking S, and then I was like, I guess it can be a little frustrating. I... So I, I was a. I was thinking TikTok S, and then I was thinking Rainbow Ride or whatever in A. Really, I I like that TikTok one's intimidating more. to me. Yeah. So uh, what I'll say, t- Quaid's kind of talked me up uh, <laughs> in, in in raising it a bit here because it is one of the final levels, so it should be a little difficult, especially if we're thinking in in terms of like not needing all 120 stars to complete the game um you know i i guess Mm -hmm. i guess i i would i would go a what if we plopped both of these final ones in a i think that sounds like agreeable right that's a good Mm -hmm. compromise i think i think so because if you think about some of the stress that the last one gives that would bring it to an a instead of an s because that one requires so much accuracy compared to, you know, falling down and trying. Because if you fall off something, you're probably going to just start the level over. I do <laughs> I'm think talking about the Rainbow Cruise. <laughs> yeah, I do think these are both appropriately difficult. Like I, I like that they're so hard, but they are. Yeah, yeah. they're not quite, not quite as fun to play. Like for no, some but, of the but stars, they're, yeah. but they're rightfully difficult for where yes. they're supposed to be. Yeah. Okay. So a. Yeah, put them both in A. McKenna, you're down with that, right? Yeah. A. A. We got a nice P going. They're great. They're great. Not perfect, but great. They're close, though. They're close. They're pretty close. Um, I guess that makes it Quaid's turn. Ooh. Do I want to... There's two I want to... I'm debating to pick between, because I like them both, but... Let's talk about the pyramid level. Sandland, yeah, shifting sandland. Okay, yeah. this, this one alone. Sick one. I love this map because yeah. after you do everything, I would always <laughs> used to just grab the turtle shell and just ride around in the sand, even the dangerous yeah. quicksand, because yeah. I'm I'm stupid like that. Even that like deathly sand where those like uh, square boxes are going around. I'd always go around there too. I just, I would just be like Tony Hawk, risky business. I'm going in. I want to see how risky I can jump around and mess around. One of my favorite maps to do, even after getting all the stars, I'd like to just ride oh, around on the shell. The inside. inside, 
It's called yeah, the inside, yes. The pyramid the inside. inside. The I, I feel like any level that has like a That's... like a cool boss that isn't like like it's got like a really unique boss. Yes. yes. Oh, you unique. Know? We call it the Bongo Bongo type of boss. <laughs> yeah, it was Bongo Bongo before they made Bongo Bongo. <laughs> it's the original Bongo Bongo. He said yeah. Bongo. You know, some some levels, the the bosses are. I don't want to say that they're they're like lazy. They're just not as like originally put together as some others. And and I feel like this is one of the ones that has like a unique boss that is different from anything else in the game. Yeah, yeah. it brings a lot of different unique ways to get stars. Mm-hmm. Like and you, you can, can have, fly the, around. the bird can take your hat. And yeah, the bird can take that hat. <laughs> And then you can go after the bird. It's fun to chase the bird. Do you have a? Do you have a? Oh, well, McKenna, what do you think? Do you have a? Do you have a? Uh, opinion, like a place that you would put it, probably. Uh, yeah. Well, I, I think I put it pretty high. I, no. Uh, I don't know. I can't think of anything too. Frustrating in this one. No. Yeah. You like, did that. You did that one where you had to like fall down. But yeah, you did, but you did okay. but it was still fun. Like even the parts were, that were maybe difficult were like still. I was still having fun mm-hmm. when I was messing up, and uh, you can Ooh. kind of get like a two, almost like two levels in one here. Yeah. Plus, you know, you get those tornadoes that like shoot you up in the sky. Ooh. Don't True. Can't forget I, that. I could go S here. S. Yeah. I'm uh, thinking S2. It's one of Absolutely. my favorite. Lo- it's one of my yes. top two levels, probably. All right. so. It's got to be Absolutely. an S then. I think. It- um, I think it should go in E. I think Michael. I, <laughs> yeah, I, think yeah, it's Michael. I, I agree with that. So we'll, I agree we'll make it a little S. No. <laughs> <laughs> I, I agree with S. <laughs> okay. Trying to be controversial over there, are we? <laughs> uh, no, I, I, I do, I do love that level. That brings it over oh. to. Uh, to our end, yes. um, uh, McKenna, you, you... Yeah, which which one did I want to? Which one do I want to? Just uh... to recap, what we got left, we've got Snowman Land, Hazy Maze Cave, uh, Thw- Thwomp's Thwomp, Fortress, Thwomp's Fortress mm-hmm. uh, yes. Jolly Roger, or what's it called? Jolly, Jolly Roger, Roger Bay. Bay. Uh, yeah, Lethal Lava Land, Tall Tall Mountain. A uh, tiny, huge island, and then the uh, the the green cap, whatever that's called, the metal cap, <laughs> metal the Mario, metal, cap. metal Mario in the metal world. Um, let's do uh, let's do tiny, huge. Yeah, island. Mm-hmm. cool. Uh, this is really cool. Is that you can enter a different painting to like, yeah. change your size. That's that's one thing for I mean, sure. Yeah, just like that, the fact that you can be two different sizes on this level and it makes things uh, very different to you yeah know, navigation, the way you fight enemies, uh, whether or not you can even do certain things. Uh, there, it makes it really fun. There's a cool fish. There's yeah. a cool fish that made me think of the Jack and Daxter fish. Jack and Daxter I think, fish. I think it's cool seeing Wiggler in this <laughs> level. Yeah. Um, yeah. There's a think... location called Wiggler's Cave, which is cool. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah. I don't I don't think yeah. as a boss, Wiggler is is more mechanically impressive than the Shifting Sandland one, but I, I still like Wiggler is one there. of the weaker bosses. Yeah, one of the weaker bosses. Um, you can take okay. his coins though, for his red. You get coin. to rematch Koopa the Quick. His race yeah. is like yeah. kind of. It could be better. That's a point thing. Yeah, <laughs> like remember when I played it, I kept going because I didn't think I was already there, and then I missed it because yeah. it was so short. <laughs> some of the wind, the the wind parts that are supposed to blow you up can kind of be not work all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very, I, I felt that one. <laughs> it's like very specific location, wind gusts. 
but I think it still stands out as very unique. And I think, yeah, I would say your... just shy of S in my opinion, but I don't think that's bad because I think all the ones that are in A have very standout gimmicks and are all unique and cool levels. So like, that's just my opinion. Like, I think it could fit in A pretty well. Plus, I like the idea to even get to fight Wiggler. You have to go on top of the mountain when it's yeah. tiny, crush the hole. So then when you go back as when it's big world, you busted the hole. So it like plays That's off a like Zelda puzzle both right world. there. Yeah, Minish yeah, Cap rips yeah. this off. Yeah, I think it's an <laughs> yeah I, I think it's an A for me. Oh, it's, it's at an least an A. Okay. A is too We've got. I can go down. I could go A. I could go S or A. I... Okay, we've got two on the fence. We've got an S and two A's. So, I think I guess it goes an A then. <laughs> well, no, the on the fence people we gotta. They gotta decide. Quaid and oh. McKenna, right? I think you you guys well, could make the decide. Do we have any arguments for either way? <laughs> I'll give you a fun thing I like to do to mess around on this map. I like to get the turtle shell and then taunt the uh, giant fish to eat me and <laughs> run away cool. from him. I like yeah, whatever the heck I did with the turtle <laughs> shell on this level. <laughs> oh, like, yeah, yeah that when was you insane. went up and then <laughs> fell onto the grid. Yeah. Oh, that was yeah, it was awesome. I yeah. think there there's a lot of things you can do since you can like go through the levels as big and small. You experience it in two different ways, and I don't know. There's a lot to do in it. I think even additional exploration gives it that factor too. Mm -hmm. Like even after you finish all the stars, like yeah, I kind of want to just go mess around on this level. Yeah, it's one of the levels you, you can just go back to to have fun. Yeah, and with sure. that, I would say S tier. <laughs> Yeah. Like if, it, if it's a level so fun that you it makes you want to go back to play, it has to be an S tier. Yeah, I'm kind of thinking like you you have to do this like go through the same areas uh, to to get everything uh, you know as big and small and uh, but it it never feels like it's like too like you're doing it too much I guess. It, yeah. it all it feel they make it feel very uh, new. I do not have a strong enough stance to to try to make an argument for same. A. So same. So if, if everyone else wants to put it on S, then yeah, that sounds cool with me. Cool. All right, I want to do the green cap. <laughs> Let's get rid of that. One. <laughs> Let's get rid of that one. Uh, okay. Honestly, though, it's I I always found just finding it. Compared to the other ones, correct me if I'm wrong, it's the only one you find in a level. Yes. And yes. I, yeah. I always thought that had such a, like, it adds to the mystique of it. And then I think, I don't know, like, that area, just, like, the first time you get the cap and, like, the music is different than the other caps. I know that's, like, we haven't really factored in music in a lot of these because a lot of them, they reuse music, so it's, you can't yeah, really... That's the thing. Um, Though, I, badass. yes, as, as a kid, you know, when you, you know, beat that level or you accidentally get sucked into the water, it, it's kind of mind blowing when like you come out from the waterfall and you're like, it was behind here the whole yeah. time. Yeah, yeah. So, I, I remember thinking the same thing. Yeah. Uh, so based on my favorite of the three switch yeah. level, actually. I, I know I, at the beginning you said, "Oh, the blue one is the better one," but I think this uh, is my favorite one. Well, I think I yeah. like the I like the challenge of the blue one more, and yeah, I like the vibes yeah. of this one more. And it's like they're just that close for me. So we're thinking C tier, I'm guessing. I'd be thinking C tier. C tier, if you are <laughs> the only C argument. Here. Let's hear it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah Quaid. Oh, yeah. The only argument I could give this to make it even a B tier consideration is if you were ranking all three switches in its own thing, like the Bowser. Oh, switches. should we do that? I'm, I, I'm okay with that because yeah, I, I, people I was, seem to really like this one because of I, the metal vibes. Yeah, I was personally thinking B for that I like this one as well. More than I like Hazy Maze Cave, to be honest. So <laughs> B tier now. is good for me. Mm. <laughs> okay, well, let's put in B. All I right. think everyone's McKenna. You're not opposed. I I'm pretty happy with this. She's happy. Look at okay. This. Look at this. Yeah, so we happy. got a nice. Uh, we just need to go. Step. Uh, like boop boop. Yeah. Yeah. yeah we'll we'll right. get that. <laughs> okay, it's back to the top. I I I uh 
I uh, what's it called? I I pass my time. All right. Uh, I'm gonna pick my favorite level that you guys won't put in S, but I would like to put in S. Uh, Little mm -hmm. Lava Land. I love this level so much. I used to go in there just to have fun. Like it was the level I would go in, not even to get any stars, just to move around. Mm -hmm. I love fighting the bullies. Like they were the bullies like are awesome. It, it's fun to fight enemies that don't just like disappear. Like you have to push them in the lava. You it have to like murder them. Fight. Yes. Yes. Yes, this is where my uh, serial killer instincts uh, started to go. Oh, no. um, <laughs> I can agree with that. The other uh, thing I'll add on to it is the turtle shell. You get that there yeah. too, and you can do whatever yeah. you want in the lava land. Minus the volcano. But the volcano's fun because there's two different paths for stars. What, what about, and, though, the red coins? The red coins <laughs> is the one thing that would kind of makes this level not as well i don't know you, how how much that would actually take it down you know it's would just, you consider it free real estate <laughs> it's real, free real estate uh, <laughs> it could have been really cool if they use that turtle shell more as like a red coin star around it but I don't think the the red coins of this level necessarily drop it too much for the, for what is in the rest of it. When I was young, it was my favorite red coin of all the game. <laughs> I what? love going. Yeah, I love it. I don't know. I love that little uh, slidey puzzle Bowser thingy. That it feels like better. they have it there like, to have you do you... a slide puzzle, and then they they like were like, okay, we can't get this in here so let's whatever just put the red coins there <laughs> do you, well they they know so my question is do you like the slide puzzle or do you <clears> like <throat> the fact that the coins are there with the slide puzzle because the I, slide puzzle could be there without the coins being there uh, i like <laughs> that the coins are all there i don't know it was an easy star to get i remember just uh, i don't know i liked everything being in the same area the same way you didn't like that um the the co the red coins in the um, the the mountain one I, I don't remember the name uh were this like is the opposite problem far apart. yeah it's the opposite thing <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I don't know I, I I liked like this quick quickly getting there getting the coins enjoying a little puzzle that was a bit random and scary but not that much I I don't know why I like in the lava <laughs> well I can be convinced so I want to hear what everyone else like you're saying S McKenna what do you where are you at with it the inside of the volcano is cool. A. A. Okay. I'm on the volcano. I'm on A or I'm on A or S. That's yeah. That's where I am. Mm. So Quaid, well, I think you gotta. I gotta beat that guy again. <laughs> because of the location of these courses, they're right next to each other. The sand and the lava world. Which one do you like more? I prefer the little level then, but I know it's well, I don't, I don't know if I agree with that. I know, <laughs> I know. From well, they are comparable because <laughs> one has like they both have the like centerpiece you go inside, you know, and then they, they yeah. have both, they both have terrain that's kind of difficult. The thing is, um, I like both of them to where I would consider them both S's. But if you want the standpoint of, well, do I like the sand or do I like the lava? Uh, I don't, don't want. I don't want that point. No, it's not like the. No, it's not no, like the was, but I'm like all, Yeah, but I will say I'm with Demos. I still consider it an S in my. I'm opinion. open to S. And that name is the best level name. Come on, Lethal. Okay, I vote. I change. I just. I vote S. Yes. S for sand. I vote A. <laughs> I vote A, but but if if ever, if it's outvoted, then yeah. What do we got? I think three S's and two A's. Yeah. All yeah. right. S Sounds for like steering. You, you're not into it. Uh. I I, I could be convinced. Cool. I mean, S is fine. He's like, talk me down. I'm like, it's it's definitely mm. for me not as fun as some of the other ones in S. Okay, can low S. S. You can put it at low S. <laughs> we're not doing that. But, we're but doing um, that. you know, so we gotta, I need one to go here. Yes. Just even if it's yeah, just no, this is second. perfect. We're setting up the stairs. How many you pick? <laughs> okay, um, Michael. Okay, 
here, here maybe this maybe this will help <laughs> for you mckenna now due to my own biases maybe this oh. would go into s tier <laughs> but I, i'm willing to recognize my own biases um and you know jolly roger bay oof Ooh. Uh, i think it's, it's it's it feels kind of like a small level um but I think that's just because the ship moves around uh and and that kind of adds some level to it. I I I I think I think this could go in like an A maybe. You're talking um, yourself down. <laughs> well, I think it would go into an S because I uh love all piratey aesthetics. Uh -huh. So, the, you know, for me, thematics mm. alone are just like, oh, great. I love this. Okay. Um, so I'm trying to be realistic here for like taking away the, the fact that it's piratey. Um, I, I like the eel. Um, mm. The eel. No good son of a. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. That, that, that rotten scoundrel, the eel. Mm -hmm. Um I like that you get to lure him out not once but but twice uh for different reasons and you get to chase down his tail. The eel had a lot of uh mystique as well yeah. to me. Any sea creatures in the game, I always when I was a kid were like, "Ooh, what is what is this? What's this doing here?" Going inside the the ship after the eel leaves is is kind of cool and then the, you know, if you're quick, you can kind of get to the star right away. Uh, otherwise, you get to do a little platform section going up. <laughs> you get to suffer. <laughs> uh, it's, a, it's definitely having, rewarding. Having an, the underwater cave is uh, a fun thing to find uh, when you first play the game. This is We haven't talked about the music, too, and I know they reused this track, but this makes really good use of that track and how it changes and stuff. Yeah. This has what I would say one of my favorite tracks in the game. Yeah, um, it is aside the aside from game. like bomb on battlefield, you're yeah. persuading me of being an S tier right now. <laughs> <sighs> I want to hear some other arguments. I would put it into S, but I I realize my bias. Uh, but mm. yeah, what's everyone else think? Well, I'm trying to think <laughs> negative things about it. Um, when I was young, it was one of my least favorite levels. I did not like it at all. I thought it was slow. I didn't like going underwater. Uh, and as an adult now, I feel the same. <laughs> um, <laughs> honestly, on my list, I would have probably put it at C. But I can Whoa. definitely go up for Whoa. you guys. But yeah, me, I would vote at C. I don't like it. I, uh, mm -hmm. I accept the music. The music is S tier, for sure. Okay, but, we got uh, two S's and a C. Hi. <laughs> I'm the red I see. Guy. McKenna, you were going to say something, right? Yeah, I think, like, aesthetics and vibes are, like, very high, top tier for this. But I think maybe the, the actual gameplay is not there. Okay. Not quite there. Uh, what makes you say that? Is it the swimming? <laughs> Some of the, none, of the, none of the challenges are, like to like fun i think there's a fun yeah. factor in the exploration yeah element. it is it is yes. nice to explore uh, yeah but i will say that two of the levels involve the treasure chest system which <laughs> is, is like it's it's okay it's not like really? that fun <laughs> it's just like oh i touch a chest and i get zapped you yeah. know and like it'd be ooh, fun you got it wrong it'd be Maybe fun if they want something to tell you which one mm. in which order like a little puzzle to instead of getting punished for them yeah yeah but maybe not do the same thing twice in one world what about low c or low a whoa whoa i think i i mm. i'd say if i have to take it out of s i'd put it in a high a <laughs> well hold on you've got to be reasonable though because we've got someone <laughs> saying c <laughs> what is McKenna saying? Because she wasn't. Yeah, I, I'm. Yeah. I'm saying A. McKenna saying A. Really? I think. Oh. I would also say A. Yeah, I could. And I would I say. 
I would say low A. I could <laughs> say A because a. of some of its flaws. Uh, to me, it's an S, but if we're averaging everyone's scores, let's, you know, I, I I accept it. Let's put it in high A for Michael. Let's put, <laughs> let's, let's put it right Wait, above TikTok clock. Uh, don't be hasty. <laughs> you, can, you can put it in it's low A. It's not as good as Rainbow Cruise. Davos put that in C. You can put it in low A for Davos. <laughs> Oh man. Okay. If you guys keep backing up, you're just gonna throw it in the B tier. <laughs> oh, oops! It fell in the B tier. Well, <laughs> oh darn! Wow, look at that. Um, look at that diagonal. I guess it's that so makes cool. it Quaid, right? It does. Yeah, well, up here. All right, Quaid, mm. mess up our stairs. Yeah. Which map is gonna mess up the staircase the worst? Wait, quick, create an F and then put one in E. <laughs> I don't think any of them. I'll pick one, one that I have like a like a meh, a love and hate relationship with. And I think it's going to have to be Tall Tall Mountain. Oh. Huh. huh. There's, I feel there's good and bad with it. <laughs> yeah. It feels so of... lengthy going up the mountain. That's one negative. The death slide is good that you start there if you do die. But how to get 100 coins, you have to do the slide. Yeah, I feel like mm. the the difficult part about some vertical levels in the game is that is that once you do the vertical part about the level... It gets tedious doing it again. Yeah. Like the tick-tock clock argument you're employing. Right. Uh, but I do think Tall Tall Mountain is more interesting than... TikTok clock, like climbing the mountain, because there's there's more than one path for for one thing. Like you can go around, but there are some points where you go vertically, uh, and you have like it's it's not just find the stars. It's like free the the monkey, find a secret slide, use uh, the cannon to go to the star. Like it, it has variety. I I like mm. it a lot. Well, yeah. it doesn't really specify how to get to the cannon. You know, you have to like, do that weird jump down. Yeah, or is there a secret a, teleport? A secret so slide in it. <clears throat> yeah. And there's that hard it's, secret slide. I don't the... know what... It, I think it's <laughs> just, like, the the theming is so... is, like, not quite as distinct. I do like the, the mushroom aspect of it, because, like, it makes me think of the classic Mario levels where you're just, like, there's, like, the Mari, the mushrooms just out in the, you know gaps that you can fall in but like mm -hmm. otherwise i feel like we've had other mountain levels and then this one is just like yeah it's um it's a mountain do you do you think the monkey that steals your hat is a plus or a negative it's a, a plus. plus that is so <laughs> awesome it's that's so funny that's the best thing about the level i think it has monkeys. Mm. i i me for me it's an s but i know it's gonna go lower than that but for me, it's an S. I okay. love this level. I give it a B because I'm so mixed with it. Oh, huh. I there's nothing that I like hate about it, but I, there's nothing that like I'm like I love it. I think it's a really solid level. I I would honestly I would probably agree with uh, it. Would be the best thing in B. It would be a high B for me, but we can obviously yeah. negotiate here. B tier. Again, is it means good for me, so I'd put it in B. But where McKenna put it? Yeah, I don't. I don't have super strong feelings about this level. Mm -hmm. Uh, monkey. Monkey's cool. <laughs> uh, monkey gives it a B. Monkey. There's yeah. Yeah, <laughs> I thought of that. <laughs> We could put it jumping around the mushrooms can be a little in the way. Like cool. the Bowser from the Mario movie. Monkey. Monkey. Yeah. Monkey. Uh I love that. And we could compromise and do A, you know? Like a no, little it can B. be it can be IB. If everyone's going B and I'm the only one with an S, that's fine. It's a B, I think, in that case. Oh, okay. Uh, unless McKenna think it's an A, but uh... Yeah. Let's let McKenna decide. <laughs> It's on you. I can put it in B. Okay, McKenna says B also. All right. We don't. The we IFB. don't hate it though. It's the highest of Bs. Yeah. Way better than Dry Dry World. Yes. 
Yeah, like, dry, yeah. dry world. I think just not, pop it in and then change. The... You know, we're not doing that. We're not doing <laughs> high B, but it's oh my, high B. Dry world. We're doing the highest of Bs. So. Yeah. Did you, it refused to lose the B crown. Yeah. It was it's, the right, tallest, it's the tallest of all the Bs. Yes. Right, we've got three <laughs> left, and we did not avoid uh, getting rid of all the really good ones. Uh, we got rid of all the really good ones. I think we've got... You think so? Um... Mm. McKenna, what are you going to do? I mean, there's one here that maybe isn't a really good one, but yeah, I think I'm... the other two are pretty great. Yeah, yeah, true. I hope we're talking about the same. Snowman? <laughs> Plus two human snowman? One That's what I would... I would have picked like Snowman people. because it's it's lower for me. Yeah, uh, same. Dang it. So I, 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 I think we should do it. What makes you feel it's lower? Um... Well, how does McKenna feel about it? Yeah, what does McKenna think? Um, <laughs> well, oh, McKenna, you hate this level. Why do you say that? This has the part where you have to do the jump with the oh, where yeah. it we knocks did you into so the. So much experimenting on this level. Oh God, <laughs> this this platform was my enemy, though. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, getting to the shell and then collecting the coins. Well, the first and time if... I played it, just like the platform where you have like stuff moving at you and you have to jump and you have to like triple jump to get up. Oh, the slide! <laughs> the that first pushes time you I played it, I was like, I was having a a struggle, a real struggle. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think I still probably struggle. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the uh, igloo's not really that exciting. It's kind of cool, though. It is, but it's just I, the, ice walls. The concept of the igloo is really cool, but yeah, I have to agree with Quaid. Once you go inside, yeah, it's just it's just an a little ice maze, but not I don't know, not in a way that excites me. I was extremely I the impressed when I found outside. that you could just jump on the snowman and. Or on the penguin? Or the, the penguin, penguin, the penguin, yeah. Oh, yeah. And take, yeah, take guys, it for a ride. You didn't know you could do that. And I'm like, hey, you can just hang on the penguin. Yeah, was like, what? That was awesome. <laughs> also, the um, one star where you just crawl, crawl through that like ice block is kind of, it's okay, but it's kind of like underwhelming. More exciting. I think that one is a little better than the igloo. I, I love this level so much. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, it was the last one I found. When I played when I was young, like I, I had beaten the game and I had never found that level. And then oh. on the second playthrough, I found it and I was so happy. Like, oh my God, there's a new level I can play that I didn't know about. Mm -hmm. I actually like it even more uh, than uh, the mountain, uh, the previous uh, snow mountain level. Like this mm -hmm. was a nest for me. So again, I'm the black sheep of the group, <laughs> but I, I love every star in this level. I, I love going in that little, uh, Ice fort. I love fighting that bully, that ice bully. Ice bully is cool. Gotta give him uh, points for the ice bullies. bully. <laughs> There's a fun uh, 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 Koopa shell. Like I, I like having to use that shell to get the red coin. That I is like cool. Going up. Uh, I like going in the igloo. I think it was nice. Uh, and uh, they they remade that in the Nintendo DS, which we're not reading here, but they changed the entire igloo, which was cool too. Uh, oh, no, I uh, see because they were like, "This needs some improvement." <laughs> yep. They changed a lot of things in the. the yeah, the, the, I think all the levels, right? Yeah, and this yeah. was the only level that has damaging water because it's so cold that you. Yeah, I think it's cool. I, I, I love the color scheme. I don't. Know. I, mm. I, I, I'm not a fan of a level that, like, locks you out of getting a star without just knocking you out of the level because then you have to find a way to like die i get it you can hit exit level well i guess then you go back I get, to the... yeah then you go all the way back oh. you get so many lives in that game it doesn't matter dying <laughs> yeah well not everybody knows that um yeah well but then you have to be very specific on getting the red coins because it, you only have a couple chances to jump on one of those flower guys to get you to where the turtle shell's at, that you need to go get the red coins underneath the blue chili guy. Mm -hmm. So that's one negative. Because if you mess up once, it's like, well, the level's done. Can't get red coins. 
It's also one of the three levels where you can lose your hat, which is cool. I, I like the level. That is losing bonus your hat bonus is hat. always cool. Yeah, losing your hat is yeah. always cool. And if you, so if, <laughs> what happens if you lose it and you leave it there? That's what like we did. Strength. That's what we did that when we it, played it. You just find it there. And you just, just, yeah, you just walk back and it's going to be there. I thought a snowman took it and then, like, you couldn't kill him. <laughs> <laughs> I wish. I wish. A me, uh, snowman I became uh, like, alive because of your yeah. only. So it's I like the idea of the, snowman, of, of the snowman taking it. Mean, you specified that you can't kill the snowman. So like it just permanently has your hat now. <laughs> this immortal snowman. <laughs> it's my I hat. Thought. I mean, am I wrong or has it not happened to anybody else? Hey, I, I don't hey, remember Jimmy. that. <laughs> I, uh, I don't remember a snowman taking No, I don't think that happened. I, yeah, just... I remember somebody got their hat knocked off and I went back yep. in and got this yes. one. Yes, that was yeah. me. I, I lost it and I was like, nah, we're not going back yeah. to get it. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I it was we... like random child fake memory. I think so. Yeah. I think uh, we need to draw I, out Maybe you some, were thinking uh... about the monkey. Like the monkey stealing it from the you. Monkey yeah, takes it. Like the monkey takes it. I don't Maybe. know. Maybe yeah, you might you might be right. Mm -hmm. So I'm the only I obviously I'm the only one saying yes tears. What are you guys thinking? I think of the main levels, it might be might be my least favorite. Oh my god. Really? Yeah. I you're saying S. I sincerely I would have probably put it and looking at our list now in C. Okay. I there's I no way this is better than it, Paradox. It's just... yeah. I mean, no, I said that wrong. This is better than Dire Dark. Yeah, Dark. there's no way it's under Dire Dark. <laughs> yeah, that's I, what I'm here to say. I would put Forgive this. I, I would say B for me. I would also say B. Mm. Can, can we do B? Yeah. Hi B. Yeah, hi B. That's fine. <laughs> I personally think it's that? an A. We said we oh, okay. Oh, oh, so we've oh, got a C, two Bs, an S, and an A. Oh, I think that oh, that's either a low A or an I. I think I think that's a high B, is what that is. <laughs> oh, I feel oh, I that, kind of feel bad for putting really all these faves of Dame. Well, we got he got his it's lava. Okay. Yeah, I got my lava, so I'm happy. <laughs> I can argue a high B. High B, just like Tall Tall Mountain. <laughs> <laughs> the highest no, of bees. Wait, put it. Tall yeah, tall put it tall below tall tall mountain. mountain. No, 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 no. It goes in front of it. It's okay. Put it in front. Whatever. We're not doing. We're that, not but... doing this. Ranking Try moving tall tall. Uh, yeah, we're, 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 we're not doing this. Sorry, this is a mountain I have. Like tall tall mountain's a mountain I don't want to die on. So uh, yeah, there okay. you go. I I have to pick this one. Hazy maze cave. I hate it so much. <laughs> I do not. <laughs> I, I even though I struggled, I like this one. I this is the first time. This is this is the one I associate the music with, uh, the most. Like the song fits this level the most of all the ones that have it. Um, yes. and I just don't. I mean, honestly, it just has. I mentioned it with the eel before, but it has the Loch Ness monster <laughs> creature. Oh, uh, Nessie. Nessie. and that always just Sorry. like. That always just, I don't know, freaked me out as a kid. And that has a path that leads to the cap. Um, yep. I don't know. The other, like, I don't know. It also just, it's like weird. Like, the layout is always weird. And there's parts of the level where you can see other parts of the level. But it's not like, it's like, how do I get there type thing. It's just like, it is a really strange kind of, like, weird underground level. So... I I don't know I I can agree it's not the best but I I have a fondness for it like where I would have I would probably looking at everything now I would put it in A but I know that's probably not where it'll go so I like the rolling boulders in it the boulders <laughs> you can smack my boulders the wall so jump funny getting hit by the boulders and getting knocked off the boulders seem conflicted. Uh, like Goose said earlier, mm -hmm. for uh, the snowman level, I would personally put this one at C on the <laughs> list. Uh, it's one of my least favorite ones. It's an A for me. Okay, two A's and a C. Yeah, yeah. McKenna, you look conflicted. 
I I don't know. I feel like this has like some highs and some lows. Fair. That's fair. What's your what is your lows that you see? Uh, Easy maze. God, yeah. <laughs> just like does navigating. It, does it help that that one of the first things you see in the level is actually a map of the level on the wall? Yeah, Isn't but how useful? It, it's not useful at it's all. Not, it's, it's not terrible. useful. It, it, it's, it's not useful, say, um, but, but it's it, cool. It gives it. <laughs> I, it I love much like Dire Dire Docks. I love the idea. It gives it such like an industrial vibe that like this cave is like used for something. You know, like people like use it. <laughs> I guess that's for cool. practical <laughs> purpose, even though clearly they don't do not. You know, actually, cave part. <laughs> Remember yeah. how Later's. how unfun it was to get all hundred coins on that level. Remember, Goo, lawn jumping is one of my favorite things <laughs> yeah. to do in the game, and this has yes. a lot of lawn jumping yeah. portions. That's the best move in the game. A lot. <laughs> how many times do you get to wahoo on this map? Uh, <laughs> quite a bit. There's a lot of times where wahooing is necessary on this map. <laughs> uh, what's your opinion on the red coins of this map? Fun. I like the platform thingy, and then climbing on the poles. So you I, got the, the little switch like thing. It. Yeah, I was gonna say you got that switch thing that you have to press arrows, bumps into the walls, shakes like crazy, yes. starts going the other direction. You got to get four. Is it four on that one? And then you have to go to the pole, navigate to the pole with it to get to the last half exactly. of exactly, and then take that little lift around. Yeah. Hmm. You just gotta not crash into I think it's thing. tedious and it can be tedious because if you fall you gotta work yeah. your way all the way back up. And there. you have to reuse that platform to move the air move the arrows. Like I, I don't like it. Yeah. <laughs> That's what can bring it down a letter for me. At least that and the it's got really good positives and negatives. That red star one is a pretty big negative. And the hundred coins isn't fun to get in that one. Yeah, the hundred coins is a pain to get I, there yeah, too. I've never thought. That's the thing is, like, I guess until we did this, I hadn't thought too hard about uh, until we played it like hundred percent. Like, I had never thought too hard about the hundred percent the coins, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, yeah. like, I I do agree. Like, I that one was annoying to do, um, but it doesn't. I mean, it doesn't detract. Like that's really for me the only detractor. Like I kind of like everything else, so that's why for me it's A. But I know we're gonna go lower. It seems because we got Maybe two A's, not. a C, a B. We got a B, and then I think Quaid, you gotta you gotta weigh in. This could this could be a big move here. Yeah. If I'm actually a, with, no, I'm actually with McKenna. I want to rank this a B. Uh, I feel like it's gotta go B then. That's yeah. Uh, high it B has to be this way. High B. Uh, I, I don't know. Two A's. I'd say above wet dry world. Well, above wet dry world. As exciting as <laughs> well, we're not doing that, right? <laughs> we're not doing it. We're not doing it. But yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's done. That's done. It's done. <laughs> All right. All right. It's uh, right in between there. We're definitely okay. not ranking them. In Why is this our last level? I don't. It's kind of random. <laughs> The second level is the last level. Oh, it's my time to choose. All right, let me take it. <laughs> think I think hard about this. this. <laughs> I, really hard. <laughs> I, Womp's Fortress is an amazing level. I think uh, it's a great follow up to the first one. Agreed. Um, yes. It's uh, it's another one that changes. Uh, actually, actually, it's the first one that changes uh, as you do the first star. Like you, you, you have to beat the boss, and then oop, it creates a tower, the tower that's not there first of uh, when you first get in, but that's on the paint. They so build it out of the it. boss, and they definitely built it out of the boss. That was they recycle it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's got some lore to it. This is another S for me. <laughs> I know I go really high or really low, but yeah, that's an S for me. I love uh, this level. I think all mm. the stars are interesting and uh, uh, unique. I love I, the owl that's super random that you can use to just keep or or the, the owl is great. I I like that there's uh, a lot this level has a lot of fun tricks you can do on it for, for how small for, it is. It yeah. offers a bunch. It's very there's, packed. There's like many Damn. places that you can kind of perform kind of like wall jumps and like lawn jumps on this to navigate to areas in in like ways that people normally wouldn't 
Yeah. yeah. Um, and I think that's really cool. Um, it's your first encounter with the piranha plant. And you get that little lullaby that's just adorable. Very cute. And mm-hmm. even though it's a vertical level, like you get access to um, a cannon fairly quickly. So you can just go all the way up pretty easily. So it's not a chore to get up. It also has multiple pathways. Yes. Mm-hmm. And the fact that you use the cannon to sh- smack a corner of a platform. Well, not a platform. <laughs> but yeah, a corner of that little spot to where it reveals the star is really cool. It's also mm-hmm. one of the best level to do the Green Demon Challenge on. So just taking that into consideration. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, every star is really <laughs> unique on this level. Yeah. Even the 100 coins is not really, like, it's not, not stressful at all. It's, it's very fun and easy to get. I feel like there's a ton of coins. Yeah. It's not as uh, it's not as tedious as like the bomb battlefield maybe on its coin challenge, because on that one you have to use you know do the cannon uh, circles in the sky on mm-hmm. the bomb battlefield. Nah, this one's this one's pretty solid and fun overall. I would have to give it an S tier rank. Oh, I, I would give it an S. Oh, um, I would I probably would have gone A, but. Is everyone saying S? Um, what makes you feel like it would be an A? Um, I feel like I just feel like the I don't know. I feel like as a follow up, it is a good follow up to Bobomb. I feel like it does progress kind of everything slightly. It's very appropriate, but I I feel like it's um it's got that I don't know sophomore slump thing to me where it's like it's it's yet to where things get really exciting. You know what I mean? Um. It's still straightforward, but it doesn't have the, like, fresh, like, oh, this is, like, new and exciting, but, and, like, yeah, like, the boss, like, I feel like the boss is kind of, for me, it's, it's fun, but it's not, I don't know, it's iconic, I'm, I'm okay with this, it's just, I don't have, looking at all the other ones, they kind of have, like, a really standout sort of gimmick or vibe, and this is just, like, yeah, this is, like, a, it's just like another, I don't know, like we had a battlefield, now we got a fortress. I don't know, they, there's just something about it that never, it, it doesn't have that like place in my mind as like one of the, one of my go-to iconic levels, but there's yeah. nothing wrong with it either. So I, I would be fine with S if that's where everyone else is going. If I, if I can persuade you with one argument to increase it to an S for you, have you ever tried to stand on the very top of the king thwomp when he gets oh, up. Uh, <laughs> yeah i try i tried to do that when we were playing but but he, he's so wily <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's uh the only painting that represents the whole level as well like if you look at the other painting it's like all either a part of the level or an enemy within this mm-hmm. one you just have the entire level in it like on the painting which I think is pretty unique. I don't know. It's like you you're actually getting in that level. That's true. That it is iconic that it got the Yeah, it is iconic actually. Yeah. I just feel I just feel like the other ones have more standout. It's so iconic it got remade in Mario Galaxy 2. Oh really? I, There's a level I, where yeah. I think that's because yeah. it it is like the one that's like it it fits the most as like like you can kind of condense it down to a little throwback level, whereas like yeah, it it just does kind of evoke like Mario sixty four generally. Mm-hmm. I I think it's because it's so broad. Whereas the other ones like their vibes are so distinct that it would be kind of weird to be like this is the throwback to N sixty four the boo level. You know I I don't know like that would be kind of odd. You know, um, I don't know. I'm okay. I'm okay with this if that's where everyone's going. Are you, you're going S. Um, I was gonna go A, but I think we've just been outvoted. Yeah. Okay. Let's let's do low S. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't say well, it's better than Lava World. Lava World's cooler. Yeah, I mean it doesn't have yeah, the cool slide puzzle. A, yeah, I wouldn't exactly. put it above anything in S. <laughs> and we have an F, <laughs> just like I said we would get. <laughs> Yay. Um. Okay. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> cool. All right. Do we want to, or if we do release this audio wise, I think we let's do a quick run through of what our ranking is. We'll okay. save the tiers, or for people wa- watching later, uh, just to recap, we've got in the E tier, and and shout out if 
we need to change anything, but I think we've we've settled on this. But E tier, we've got the two wing cap based levels, the the hidden levels. Uh, C tier, we've got dire dire docks, uh, the vanish cap under the moat, and the the secret aquarium. Was it? Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. So we're you know we're heating up. B tier, we've got snowman land. We got tall tall mountain. Hazy Maze Cave, Wet Dry World, uh, Princess Peach's Secret Slide, is that what it's called? Uh, Bowser in the Dark World, and whatever the Metal Cap Mario level is, whatever that's called. Uh, A tier, we've got Cool Cool Mountain, uh, Bowser in Lava Land, <laughs> I don't know what it's called. In uh, the Fiery Sea. In oh. the fire sea. Oh, oh, in the oh, fire sea. sea. I, th I think the metal cap one is is the secret behind the waterfall. Uh, the sea. No, oh. the, no, no, it's not. It's the cavern not. of the metal cap. I lied. Oh, that's even cooler. <laughs> then okay, back in A, we've got uh, the tic tac clock, um, the rainbow ride. Is that what it's called? Yes. Uh, in Jolly Roger Bay, and then our S tier, we've got. Let's we'll go we'll go from low S to high S. Uh, and yeah, because we're, we're not doing that. Yeah, we're not doing that, but I think we can agree. Um, <laughs> uh, Womp's Fortress or Thwomp? Is it Thwomp or Womp? It's Womp. Womp's Fortress, but you yeah. th fight a Thwomp? No, it's a Womp. The Thwomps are the square They're the blue one guys. That goes okay. Up. Yeah. Gotcha. <laughs> okay. We've got the Fortress. Whatever it is, you know, who, we, we don't want to argue about who's really in charge. Um, <laughs> lethal, <laughs> lethal Lava Land, uh, Tiny Huge Island, uh, Shifting Sand Land, Bowser in the Dark World, Big oh, Boo's Haunt. Sky. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Sorry, Bowser in the Sky, Big Boo's Haunt, and obviously a high S, the best level, Babam Battlefield. And we agree, right? That that no. <laughs> I mean, it's not my favorite or Michael's favorite, but yeah, we agree. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, guns pointed, we agree. 